Good day everyone. We need to find the median, lower quartile and upper quartile of this set of data. We have nine items to deal with. Let's first put this data in ascending order. So the smallest number first followed by the next smallest number and so on. One, two, 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 three, four, five, five, eight. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. This, this, this is our data in ascending order. Let's find the median now. Median is n plus 1 over 2 value. n is equal to 9, which is the number of terms. So n is equal to 9. We have 9 plus 1 over 2, which is 10 over 2, which is the fifth value. 1, one 2, 3, 4, 5. Fifth value, I'm circling it in red, is 3. So our median is equal to 3. This is also called capital Q subscript 2. Let's move on to the lower quartile. also known as q1 equal to n plus 1 over 4 value n is 9 so we have 9 plus 1 over 4 just 10 over 4 just 2.5 th the two and a half value that is in between the second and the third value so that will be located here by this red line so what we need to do is add these two numbers circle and green and divide by two so let's go ahead and do that two plus two over two is equal to two and this is our value for the lower quarter q1 Let's work on our upper quarter now. Otherwise known as Q3. It will be 3 times n plus 1 over 4 th value. n being 9. 3 times 9 plus 1 over 4. 3 times 10 over 4, which is 30 over 4, which is 7.5. The 7.5 value is between 7th value and 8th value, which is located 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8 between these two numbers. We need to add 5 and 5 and then divide by 2. 5 plus 5 over 2. It's equal to 10 over 2 which is equal to 5 and that is our value for q3 the upper quartile is equal to 5 that is how we find quartiles of an odd set of data thanks for watching all the best to you